I'm going to class right now and I'm gonna be bringing the 240. I usually bike to school, so I don't feel like biking today since it's so hot. And I figured what a great chance to drive the 240. So my shifter bushing fell out again. As you guys can tell, it's a super sloppy. This feels like junk, so I gotta fix this after class. And also I'm gonna try and clean my O2 sensor because it stops working after running for a little bit. Yeah, look, it goes super lean and then it just goes to, to straight lines. So I think the sensor is dirty. Rig looking nice and clean. Oh, finding that idle. I've been fighting a power steering leak for a little bit. And it looked like it went away. I tightened up some lines after I changed the rack, but looks like it's back. That's ATF. get over the speed bump with our side skirts intact. I hope so. I've never hit this speed bump in this car. Ooh. Easy. Light work. She's still there.
my my shifter bushing definitely fell off because it it was not doing this yesterday. It was completely sturdy yesterday. And also, um, I got my ECU out because I saw this clip from my friend on Instagram. He has an RB25 S14 and he did a sick burnout and it was shooting flames out the wastegate uh, on his limiter. And I kind of want my limiter to do that. So I'm, I'm not learning my lesson and I'm gonna go play with my limiter settings again. I'm gonna see if it's on a fuel cut limit because if it's on a fuel cut limit, it'll never shoot flames. I'm gonna make sure it's on an ignition cut limit because then it'll continue to dump fuel on limiter and all that fuel will go in the exhaust and make flames. Aha, I knew it. RPM limit mode, fuel cut. We want that to be an ignition cut. Yeah, just as I suspected, the little, little custom bushing that I made right here this guy, it's supposed to be on the tip here. It just slid up because I didn't have anything holding it on, so it just popped off. Uh, let's hope that I didn't mess the tune up and it still starts. It'd be cool if my AFR is working now too. It started. AFR might be working. No, it's not. YouTuber mode right now. 
all his batteries. <laughs> this is Colby's S14. Back. I set a four. The ones that he smacked directly in the wall at The blown up Civic. The Civic has covered in oil on the windshield. It's definitely blown up. Godzilla. Godzilla's here. <laughs> GDR? There's another GDR. There's two Godzillas here. I'm gonna buy an E85. <laughs> Toast. Mr. E85. I'm on, E85. I'm on my pump tune. Uh, I'm on my pump tune right now. GDI. GDR. Carbon fiber. It's blowing up tonight. <laughs> that Civic is not surviving. <laughs> Goodbye, soldier. <laughs> it was nice knowing you. I didn't look at this. This is insane. I thought it was broken. I thought it was broken. I ain't no cars could do this. <laughs> Dude, you can like change his control arms <laughs> with it on the ground. Dude, my underglow is working again. It didn't work forever. It just randomly started working. This spot's so cool. Wow. <laughs> That's hard.
Bow. Bow. Yeah, red looks good here. All right, that's it for this video. Ugh. That power steering leak. I gotta fix that.